Hello. Here I'm going to show you how to like um, reduce the amount of space your files take up for recording videos. Because I know that they can take up space and it takes hours longer than they should. Just because, you know, it's just it's stupid. I know, it's just how, how it is. And they can keep the same quality, which is great. This is the type of files, is, like for example Windows, how I use like my Cam Studio, so it's as an AVI, which is a massive file compared to MP4. So I'll show you. What you want to do is you want to download Format Factory from here and DivX Codec from here. I'll put the links in the description below. And when you download them, for DivX Codec, you want to get like the DivX. You want to get all the different DivX things that comes with DivX Converter Player, Movie Thing, whatever. But you do not want to get all the Taskbar add-ons and stuff. If you know how to set up stuff, you should know what you want and what not to get. And okay. And so once you've got those, you download them and everything, and you set them up and everything. So, yeah. Once that's done, you should have Format Factory here, DivX Converter, and DivX Player. And this video here I made, how to record your iOS 7 screen, I'll be putting it up. And I, I just, I made it, wanted to show you how to record iOS 7 screen. But now I'm also made it because I can then show you how to reduce the size it is. Look, if I try. 294 megabytes. Now that's not that big, okay? I could, you know, put it up like that. But what's the point when it can take so much quicker? Okay. Open up Format Factory. Here. Yeah. And you click 2 MP4. Add file. Should might go to your desktop to know. Use this. Output settings. And you need to get this DivX stuff. So it does it as div, so you can get the DivX quality. And you want the 720. I'm not sure why, but just don't use these, just use these ones. It's, um, you do not want high quality in size because that's what I'll do to just do DivX 720. Okay. And then simply, okay. And here you click start. Now, it is very quick. It is actually quite quick. It takes like the 30 megabyte file, I think it takes, um, 20, 30 seconds. I'm just gonna pause it so you know I'll come back right straight away. I'll just pause it so you don't have to watch it actually download it. Here we're back and oh just in time I guess. Here the noise it says it's task completed and there's actually an no elapsed time button saying not one button the thing saying it's been four it's taken four minutes forty one seconds but you won't miss that. So just close that and it's here it's done, you know. Everything's perfectly fine. Here's the different options. So to the mobile device, so you can actually watch whatever you're watching, whatever you have on your, you know, on your phone. You can put it onto your phones and watch them, you know, fine. And there's uh, GIFs, this for QuickTime, MOV, MP4, that's for some basic phones, I don't know, some of that. Uh, there's just different types of ones, if you want. Just make a mix small or bigger, or whatever you want, really. So now we've got this, you can close it. Documents. Go uh, to. You have to go to your local disk. Type in C. Then you do FF. Oops. FF and you go to FF output. And here, as you can see, I've got some other videos I've just done. I've done. Just delete them. Here, got a thing, and as you can see here, hover over it. 294, 33.4 megabytes. Still the same quality and everything, which is just great, you know. So watch it. If we can watch it, I can show you. And as you can see, well, okay, it's not the same quality, and the reason it's not the same quality is because Cam, Cam uh, Studio, I think, records in 1080p, so this 720 is just a, not quite as good, but, you know, okay, you can put, there's probably another one like DivX Player and stuff that can do 1080, which is, you know, look, 1080, 
which is absolutely great. But uh, this one, DivX doesn't. It's just a nice, easy one, free, no dangers. So yeah, it is actually um, slightly. Oh, yeah, you shouldn't delete this version yet until you actually upload it or whatever. You're done with it. Um, it is slightly a bit worse. It's just because of I got good Cam Studio, which is high quality. But yeah, uh, that is simply just how to convert your video files to small ones, and it's great. Oh, thank you very much for watching. Please like, rate, subscribe, share with your friends. Thank you very much, and goodbye.